Hey, I'm Chris from iGUIDE, and I'm here with the iGUIDE Planix R1 camera system uh, so that I can give you a demonstration of what it looks like and how easy it is to shoot essentially an entire property from start to finish so that you can decide whether or not you want to get one for yourself. One of the really nice things about the Planix R1 is that it can go into almost any bag. You can see my favorite bag right here. The R1 rests inside along with my other gear. It's protected from scrapes and scratches by a sleeve which comes with the camera and the system shield which is like a big lens cap that covers the LiDAR scanner and camera lenses. The R1 is also very friendly when it comes to tripods. You can use almost any tripod you like as long as it's stable and can hold the weight. Setting up is just like most other cameras. Every capture starts with creating a project in the app. After that, you name the floor, you're ready to start scanning. Scanning a space is as easy as pressing one button. The camera captures 360 degree images and LiDAR measurement data at the same time, and you get to see them in real time. Overall, shooting an eye guide is very simple. Carry the camera to every space, scan that space, and make sure you've got what you need before you leave. The goal is to capture measurements for floor plans while getting the important visual information with as few scans as possible. The most common question everyone asks when they first start making eye guides is what the distance is between scans. Ideally, you want to maintain line of sight from one scan to the next. Every scan is a point of view from which the tour can be viewed. I like to imagine what a prospective buyer would want to see and place my scans accordingly. Mirrors are common and it's easiest to deal with them by creatively placing the camera and yourself so they won't be visible in the tour later. You have access to the panoramas taken with the iGUIDE camera, so removing reflections can be done in post using software like Photoshop, but it's easier to just avoid the reflections if at all possible. The overarching goal of any eye guide shoot is to capture the entire property to create accurate floor plans and a comprehensive 3D tour. You can achieve this by monitoring what you've captured in real time. The app will show you what you are capturing, and as you collect more data, it will start to resemble a floor plan and give you a good sense of what the tour will look like when it's published. Other than the available time on site, there are no limits to the number of scans you can capture. Scans can be turned off and on later, so it's usually a good idea to capture more than you need and configure the tour later in the iGUIDE portal. Larger rooms or open concept spaces may require one scan to capture, but that can make for a boring tour. It's better to capture a scan in multiple locations within a larger space that represents a different purpose. This way, someone looking at the tour can imagine themselves doing whatever activity makes sense from that point of view. Any feature in 3D space can be tagged for reference later while shooting. They are useful for highlighting important features, or in this case, a defect. It can be time consuming to walk away from the camera to hide. Two-shot mode allows the user to capture twice and automatically remove themselves from the final image. Data is automatically aligned from one scan to the next as long as line of sight is maintained between scans. There are notifications if alignment fails. You're never forced to retake a scan and can easily set and correct alignment manually. 
Sometimes a scan serves another purpose. It's intended to give a user a better sense of walking through the space. So even though it may not seem important, hallways and connecting spaces are useful for understanding how spaces feel to navigate. Even small spaces need to be scanned. Powder rooms are a great example because although they're not large, they are very important to understanding a property. And there you have it. We've shot the entire property now and you got to see everything from start to finish. Thank you for joining me and if you want to learn more, visit goiguy.com.